And hello from Istanbul. We find ourselves in the Besiktas district, not too far from the Sultan Ahmed old town. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And ahead is live action from the Turkish Superliga. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Starting 11 for Besiktas. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, they're playing the same shape, really. So it's all about getting control of that central area. And which of the wide players has the greatest effect on the game? And now they get the ball rolling. Holse. Tight. And now Ben Asser. Holse. Tight. Carlo Holse. Every pass hitting its target. Kara. And cutting inside. Rahman. comfortable in dealing with the ball played in clear foul play and as a result a free kick forthcoming can he make it 1-0 and the keeper denies them from the spot Playing it in. Crossing possibilities. Can he give them the lead? There it is! The first goal of the game, and the lead certainly doesn't flatter them. Good value for it. Well, let's take another look, and it's a very good goal. And they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. 1-0 then. Making progress. Oh, good play, this. And a chance to level it. What an important piece of defending. Rahman. Can they create something from here? But quick thinking defensively. Rafa. 
Rafa. The cross is on. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Tight. Oh, that's an interesting pass. On and on he goes. Has someone to play it to. Can he put it in? And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, here's the replay. He's done well to get his head up, pick out the teammate, and the move is good, making for a couple of finishes. It's a really great goal. And a second goal for them here. Ali Musrati. Jetson for Nance. Well, we're almost at the halfway stage and they're not making home advantage work for them one little bit here. Stuart, your assessment? Well, they can certainly play better than this. They've been too slow in possession and not aggressive enough with their closing down. Those two things have to change in the second half if they're to turn this around. Not giving him a moment's peace. Carlo Holsen. Bendassa. Holzer on the ball. Kara. Now can they make something happen? Promising looking ball. Well, nothing productive really. And that will be a corner. Trying to deliver it accurately. Oh, cleared off the line. Alert defending. Rahman. Oh, super piece of play. Well, in the final analysis, it was good defending. The first half here comes to an end. Well, such is the lot of an attacking player. Some days it works for you, on other days, not at all, Stuart. Yeah, I've been really disappointed with him today, Derek. He just hasn't looked himself, but I think it's fair to say he hasn't had great service, has he? The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Gabriel Rafa and the ball with Jetson for Nansch Colley Masuaku crossing opportunity It's opening up for them. Immobile. Well, they're eyeing that final pass, you just feel. Well, that's the end of that move for now. Well, the visitors, as you can see, have enjoyed so much of the possession. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball, which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Well, the timing was perfect. Ball one. Jetson for Nansch. It's with Rafa. Busrati. Chiro Immobile. 
Is it going to end up being productive for them? Rafa. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? Cara. Into the advanced position. Cross towards that far post. Brilliantly blocked. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. And that'll be the goalkeeper's ball. Rafa. Immobile now. Chance to play it in. Perfect challenge. He continues his run. Cleared away. Well, foul play, says the referee. Well, some referees might have reached for the yellow card, but not this one. Yeah, another foul, and he will get a yellow card, that's for sure. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. Well, strong play here. He's showing a real will to win the ball. He could pick out a teammate. He made it look simple, really. He's enjoying space. Carlo Holsen. Protecting it effectively. He ran the situation defensively and did his job. We're really closing him down. Ali Musrati. Rafa. Immobile. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. You're absolutely right, Derek. They really struggle to get to grips with the game. They always seem second to the ball, and then just a few mistakes at the back, and it's cost them. Poor performance all round. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. Played with real authority and attack, Stuart. Well, certainly a solid performance and a very good goal. But he'd be slightly annoyed he missed the penalty. It was a great result overall, though.